Oh, good day to people of the interwebs. Welcome to this week's edition of Transformer of the Week. Well, I'm going to be looking at this guy. This is TFC's Poseidon O3, or P03, Big Bite. He's Scalor. He's Sircon Scalor, done in this um, third party s s combiner style. So, he's a big fish monster thing. I call them half the cover <laughs> type of fish. You know, um, as a kid I always just wanted to some kind of prana, but he's a specific prehistoric kind of fish. But that's what he looks like, obviously, because, you know, these, these are just what prehistoric fishes look like. Well, he's a whopper, all right. He's kind of voyager-sized, lovely, just fish monster. Because, you know, prehistoric fish had legs and arms, obviously. Great. Great. Seacons, just absolutely brilliant idea. Just kind of... Yeah, hey, you know, if you enjoy the Sharks cons in the Transformers the movie, let's make a combined team of, of, of fish guys. Brilliant. And just use all these lovely colours. Oh. Yeah, he's um, just this big bite. That's what he's called. He's got a big bite. And he's just a mouth. A mouth full of point. He's quite sharp as well. Quite pointy teeth. And follows it on. Just, just absolutely lovely. Just the scale on him, because he's called scale on, and yeah, just following it through. He's a whopper, all right, I tell you that. Uh, yeah. So, things of note, he's got this lovely articulated tail, he's smashing. So go up and down. Oh, no. whoop, whoop, hello. So I can go, oh, and all these ball joints are there. Um, mine, there's supposed to be a fin there, another translation fin. Mine's missing that, so hopefully TF Express are going to sort me out with a replacement for that, so it's not in a box or anything. So, it was misassembled. Mm. Shit happens, you know what I mean? Shit happens, you get over it. And ah, it's that lovely, look at that translucent, look, everything's loopy. Marvelous, marvelous translucent pink, thin there, and then just to that mouth that he gets his name. He's named for Big Bite. And um, it's kind of a bit of wobble there, but it's Lower jaw has a lot of just hinges that you can move it up, ah, and then you just stab yourself um, with it. So there's lots of movement there that you can do that. And there is actually some hinges in some of these teeth and his fangs, but a little better to just try and just keep all the rest there because that looks that looks a bit too silly in your robotic fish demon thing. And he's got his arms, so his arms are on balls over there, so he can move slightly out, and he's got little movements there, and movements here at the, the claws, so he can be like, nom, 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 nom. And if you don't like him there, you're on a hinge thing, so you can move him back, and peg him further along into the body. And that's, that's the fish thing. So because we've got some accessories, we're just going to go with the, the stuff that makes the solo fish thing. We're not going to bother with um, the combined modes or the, or the weapon modes at this occasion. Uh, we're just going to go through this. So he gets these blasters, gets two of them. So like that. Nice pair of blasters. What I really love is the fact that they've put these teeth details on. So he just kind of goes with the theme of the character. And he comes with two Swords. Now, there are a couple of ports back here that, you know, you could pull the swords like that. Again, kind of ridiculous, but it could be kind of like banners. <laughs> the more made for, for the guns, so the guns can go in here, so you can have some gun action. Oh. Gotta be careful these handles move but they cannot tuck all the way further in and they do like go inside the body of the gun so you can have to flip them out again. But while we're here, we'll show another feature of these guns is that you kinda of get back here, you do that, and you go from a pistol to a rifle, which is quite cool. So 
He can have these, a weaponized fish monster. Awesome. So again, for this one. You can flip that out. Flip that round. Flip that out. And if you wish, so wish for your little fish, you can actually plug these together to make a little barrel gun type thing. As you do. Pew, pew, pew. That's um, Hello Beers. Now, I said we're not really going to go into the mode. He does have um, combined, it, does, it can become an arm and it can become a leg. The stuff for the leg um, doesn't come with it, it does come with his hand, but it doesn't come with his foot. The foot is used to make also the weapon mode. But what you can do, if you wish, for your fish, <laughs> look at it, all the same there. Can move his head all the way back to there, and there is a device a bit that makes this gun go in tighter. But you can stick that there, move this jaw up to hold that in place a little bit better, and again another kind of. There's just lots of possibilities with this guy. Just lots of fun. You can make him a, a walking cannon thing, weird thing, which is awesome. <laughs> That's what I like, there's options to this. But he is a transformer, so he does transform, and we're going to transform him right now. Um, it's got some involved steps, and it's got some quite easy steps. First things first is, I'm just going to unplug plug these feet. They will be feet. They will be feet. And we'll get back in here and kind of start pegging some of these panels. Move his fish legs up. Squeak them out over to here. Just so we can free up a bit of space while we're working. Again. Move all this stuff down. Get these teeth. What they don't work. I can hear that. Mm -mm -mm. Lovely, just bits of ratcheting. And kind of get back up here. Oh, it's um, there's some absolutely lovely videos of this guy already. Of the people showing off how we transform it. I'm just kind of just I'm just doing it. <laughs> you know, I'm just getting this guy transformed to kind of do this. Not sure where about you. Put these arms in robot mode, but you know, kind of, there's a lot of openness to interpretation here, so, and these kind of ball joint around and do stuff, um, so how is everyone while we're doing this, are we all okay, um, it's good, see start, more and more people start making videos again, um, Mr. Mentz, Dave Mentz has been uh, made quite a few videos this week, which is always glorious. Uh, you kind of need to figure out which way this combined joint goes, because if you go over that, you can use it as an approach in robot mode. See, we're getting into a robot. Yeah, so Dave Mentz has started to be making a few more videos, which is always good to see him. Um, Blabbering along on the internet. It's good. <laughs> Let's just say that. And there was a a um, from the wild. A um, oh, see this ball joints, ball joints, ball joints just pop up. Uh, a um, get in the van appeared from the wild from somewhere, and. Yeah, always good. 
course, we've been getting the usual. Um, I can't remember what your, your acronym is, Wilderness, for um, Epic Epic. Korean thing, Korean Nightmare Robots, whatever it's called. Um, car bot things, that some of them don't even turn to cars, whatever it's called. But yeah, yeah there's always that. It's always good to see. Um, Chris, shit, shut shit, shit, shit. That wasn't a Freudian slip. Chris, six shop changer reviews. Um, you guys have uh, hit a milestone on your uh, b- 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 subscribers, so that was good. Uh, congratulations on that. Uh, same with Mike K- Cass. Mike Kias. Um, hit a thousand, which is absolutely wow. Staggering. Um, here I am. <laughs> Whatever I'm doing. That's, I've got a robot. <laughs> I'm not a robot. So yeah, congratulations to you guys and keep up the good, awesome work that you're doing. Um, very much keeping YouTube for the Transformers fans alive. Alive! Yes. Anyway, this is the Robomon. Absolutely glorious. I mean, I don't know how well my camera can pick up this head sculpt. It, it is just a block of uh, light pipe in there, so his eyes, when the sun hits his eye, eye, eyes, is glorious. Unfortunately, I think I'm, I'm from so I'm not going to get that, that well. When I look at it, it looks brilliant. Not, not sure how brilliant it's going to look in camera. But this is a big bite. It's got all that articulation in robot mode that you want. Um, you know, nice big knees, thigh swivels. Oh, just clickety clickety clacks, clickety clacks, clickety clickety clack clack. clack. Oh, squeaky weaky, um, clickety click, clickety click. Um, oh, squeak. So all that's got there, and you know, doubly jointy. And now you can hold the sword. So we'll bang the sword in. I'll bang a rifle in and he's just oof I'm going to get the whole team of these because they are glorious and this is this, this first one just says look we're going to make this is going to be a great team but it's going to be one of those hard ones because I'm sure Piranacon in his entirety will look hella awesome. However, just this guy in his top, just this guy in both robot mode and monster fish mode look brilliant. I'm sure in cannon mode he's gonna look brilliant because it looks like a, a demon fish weapon, which is, you know, odd but cool. So it's just gonna be a quandary of, uh, of how you regularly keep this guy. I think you're just gonna have to you know what I mean? You're gonna to have to put a note in your diary and like to routinely change these around. Um, you know, to which ways you have them because they're gonna be belters in every mode that they have, and the option of the fact that it can be an arm and a leg. It's just gonna be like oh, so many choices, so many options. I like choices and options, but sometimes it's like uh, an expensive figure. Or how do I choose how I'm going to store it? You can also... Not like that. Not like that. Just give me a second. Oh, oh, oh. Which way around does this go? Take his tail off, like so. They can hold that as a weapon. It's all about the options. All about the options. <clears throat> Lovely. They've done a fantastic job. Um, yeah. It could do with more paint. Clearly, it could do with more paint, but the colours that they've chosen, the way that they chose to do this using different bits of. Coloured plastic, which are all just 
just a well chosen and the translucent plastic as well that really kind of pops it is good it could have maybe just done with just that little bit of a refining touch with a paintbrush just to you know make it just that even bit better because you know it is an expensive figure at the end of the day it's an expensive adult collectible <laughs> but other than that yeah it's well smart these swords are all going to combine together to make one massive sword as it is but until then squeaky weaky clickety clackety fishy wishy and that is my uh, transformer of the mouth <laughs> big mouth big transformer of the mouth Phil Ratchap25 where the fuck are you make a video in fact, everyone should just make a video. Make a cool transform video, please. It'd be brilliant. Everyone, you should do. And you, and you, you there, you should put some trousers on. And then you should make a video. But yeah, let's get this ball rolling, man. Let's have summer fun in the transforming YouTube community. Um, get involved online. Get to um, Transformers and such. Get to the Transformers YouTube community on Facebook. Get to uh, TF Third Party UK, I believe it's called. Um, get on these groups. Get communicating. Get talking. Get sharing your love of toys. Don't get sharing your hate uh, 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 niggling things. But get sharing your love of toys because, you know, it's worth it. And we're all going to have fun together because we all share mutual interests of, of being men children who still like Transformers and that's a good thing because <sighs> look, I'm not ripping off any dog <laughs> no stop growing you stop, don't stop playing because you grow you grow because you stop playing be big, be proud no, that's not my thing <laughs> till the next time, be excellent to each other party on dudes until then, because we deserve it, come on, bum, 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 do the fisty, bum, bum, fisto, fisto!